So you might feel awkward driving around in one of these carts at Home Depot or wherever else you go. That's totally understandable. He's kind of slow, honestly, especially compared to like my wheelchair. But I only brought my crutches, so it's fine. I don't know why, but riding in these carts makes me feel a little bit silly. But I don't have a leg. And if I were just on my crutches, I would not have any hands to hold any of the things that I was carrying. So I guess I could bring like a backpack or something if I wasn't carrying a lot of large things. Of course, there is a matter of the carts being available. They're not always available when you go to the store to try to use them. So that's an issue. And on top of that, they're not always charged. It's always polite if you are using one of these carts to return them to their charging station if you are able to do so. If you're not able to, that's okay. You can just leave them next to your car and then the employees will come and retrieve them for you. Although just like with regular carts, it's best to return your carts to the charging station if it is all possible because that helps the next person who needs to use the cart be able to find the cart and have a charged cart available. This cart goes forward when you turn this thing up and then it goes backwards when you push it down. And it doesn't work unless you're sitting in it. So if you stand up like I just did, it stops working. Turn the cart where it goes. I probably could have handled that just on crutches, but I wasn't completely sure exactly what I was going to be getting. And I wasn't sure if I was gonna be able to carry all of it. So it was just easier to use the cart, which has a convenient basket. Look at it. 